even I make mistakes, right? <laughs> uh, so this is a sphenoid bone, okay? So all this through here, okay? This is all sphenoid. You can see the sphenoid from the side, okay? This is sphenoid right here. Sphenoid comes around this way, and then comes all the way around this way, sphenoid, and then you can see it again back here, okay? Uh, there are two wings making up the sphenoid. Uh, the smaller one is the lesser wing of the sphenoid. The larger wings here are called the greater wings of the sphenoid. Uh, looking at structures, okay, there are these two pointy projections right here. These are called the anterior clinoid processes. Running in between the anterior clinoid processes is the optic groove, or also called the chiasmatic groove. Right next to that are two foramens. So there's a hole here and a hole here. And these are called the optic canals or optic foramens. So the optic nerve comes through here and then actually crosses along the optic groove right here. So anterior clinoids, optic groove, optic foramen or canal. This large depression right here okay, is called the hypophyseal fossa. It's called the hypophyseal fossa. It's separated by a ridge of bone called the tuberculum celli, that's seen here, and a ridge of bone called the dorsum celli, that would be this portion here. So tuberculum celli, dorsum celli, hypophyseal fossa, and then you have two bony points on the back called posterior clinoid processes. So this whole section that we just described Tuberculum celli, hypophyseal fossa, dorsum celli, posterior clinoid processes. This makes up something called the cella tersica. This whole section is called the cella tersica. And in the cella tersica sits your pituitary gland. Okay? So that's where your pituitary gland would sit. Now for foramens over here. Okay? There are several foramens that are part of the sphenoid bone. Starting with this first foramen right here, this is called the foramen rotundum. Going down here, we have the foramen ovale. Next to the foramen ovale is the foramen spinosum. And then more medial is the foramen lacerum. So we'll do it one more time. So foramen rotundum, foramen ovale, Foramen spinosum, foramen lacerum. Tilt it down, foramen lacerum. Okay. If we look through the orbital section here, okay, so looking in the orbital fossa, you'll see a large fissure, a large crack right here. So that's called the superior orbital, right here. That's called the superior orbital fissure. Okay, superior orbital fissure. And then underneath, okay, you'll see some bony ridges of the sphenoid right here. Okay, these ridges right here. These are called the turgoid processes. So turgoid processes. And I think that's it.